Hello. Hello and... Uh, hello and welcome to Whose Line Is It Anyway? The Improvisation uh, Programme. Uh, featuring tonight the coolest man on the West Coast from San Francisco, Greg Proops. Then from Wandsworth, the hippest man on the South Circular Road, Paul Merton. <laughs> Next from Los Angeles, actor, comedian and failed entrant for the Danny DeVito lookalike contest, <laughs> Brian Stiles. And then the most exciting thing in the Midlands since they pulled down the Crossroads Motel, Josie Lawrence. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the contestant. Right. Now, <laughs> we start with a game called Film and Theatre Styles. First of all, Ryan and Greg, if you'd like to come down to position. And I'll give you a little scene to act in in just a moment. Uh, but uh, first of all, we want some theatre style, some film style, for them to, to break into as the, case, the uh, show goes on, not the case goes on. Early talkies. Early talk. Well, you're quick off the mark. Okay. <laughs> Early talkies. Woody Late Allen. Late talkies. <laughs> <laughs> Points off there for ripping off his idea. Now, uh, Woody Allen, did I hear? Yes. Not him himself, obviously, it would be very surprising. Oh, Though he's a big fan. Anyone oh, from around here? Silent film. Greek tragedy. Oh, Greek tragedy and silent film. You did in one go, the ventriloquist <laughs> act. That's good. Samurai. 50. Oh, Disney. Sorry, Disney. Perfect, perfect, right? Yes, all right, all right. We're not aiming at getting 50. That's fine. That's uh, <laughs> very good indeed. Now, I'll give you a scene now, shall I? Uh, yes. You two people, uh, please, would you be painting a bridge? Something like the Golden Gate Bridge or the Fourth Rail Bridge or something that takes a long time. Painting a bridge. I'll give you some styles in just a moment. It's going to take all day with a brush. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm just new here. Well, take it from me, my friend. Grab that sprayer. I'll show you, I'll show you the ropes. Disney. <laughs> I like you better when you're purple. <laughs> a little in there. <laughs> this is awful. The bridge is collapsing. Oh the bridge is collapsing! <laughs> Greek tragedy. And lo, the bridge did fall! <laughs> and my mother was killed underneath it! If I were like your mother, I would be a woman. <laughs> Woody Allen. Perfect. I'm trapped on a bridge with a member of the SS. <laughs> <laughs> Could you show me how to work the, uh, the Why thing? is it I always have to show you? You can't, you can't work it yourself. I'm tired of showing people. You no, this, if you could just show me because I I've just, had I don't want to. Uh, there, what's <laughs> there? Early talkies. Must finish the bridge. Yes, the bridge must the be bridge finished. The bridge must be finished now. <laughs> <laughs> we finish the bridge before dawn, we can take the rest of the day off. Yes, then we can save the orphanage. <laughs> and let's end on horror. Seems I've been painting the bridge with blood. <laughs> the blood of the last man who worked with me. That's funny. I've never painted bridges before. Usually I'm used to sawing animals in half. If that isn't worth 100 points each, then it must be worth seven. So let's, uh, let's go on to the next pairing of Josie and Paul. If I'll come down, I'll give you another scene in a moment. Some different styles now, different theatre styles, film styles. Thunderbirds. Thunderbirds. Terminator. What? Terminator. I'll combine those in one, I'd have thought. Cut <laughs> their strings. Uh, Western. Western, yes. The Clangers. The Clangers. <laughs> it's an Irish pop group, isn't it? I don't know. Yeah. Film. We're doing a game show, isn't it? Gangster, Gangster film. film. Yeah, that's a good one. Gangster film. Porno as well, yeah. Porno? <laughs> you're, um... You're... You Just have to hear that. <laughs> Maybe because you said it. Yeah. It'd be surprising if you didn't hear it. I've done, we've done Thunderbirds before, though. Yeah, I think you've done porno before, yeah. Paul. <laughs> <laughs> was, that, was that just at uh, your party? I can't remember now. Um, anyway, Josie and Paul, what are you going to do? You're going to be two people at a seance, please. I'll give you some styles in a minute. Um, excuse me. You have come to break the veil that hides the next world from ours. Yes, and to contact my husband at the same time. Is your husband dead? 
Well, I hope so. He hasn't been, he hasn't been home for four years. Weston. Shall I, uh, shall I just sit down here? Yeah, sit down over there, Wayne, aren't you? <laughs> it's porno already, just say. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I would assume it was a horse, but there. That's... Yeah, it's just porno. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's take it on to Thunderbirds, then. <laughs> could, could you tell me if my husband is here? I, I don't think so. And <laughs> <laughs> right, a Terminator movie. You're lying on the floor. Yes, I'm lying on the floor. <laughs> no, I will get up. I cannot be destroyed, <laughs> except by a linguist coach. <laughs> My grasp of English is not very good, but I am a robot. Well, let's get on with the sounds before I kill you. OK. Oh. I don't know what this is. Clangers. <laughs> Clanger would go. Like to go to visit the soup dragon, wouldn't you, Clanger? <laughs> let's see if we can get through to the soup dragon. <laughs> well, I've still got no idea what that is. But, uh, <laughs> it's porno. <laughs> in on the porno gangster film. I've just got in touch with Al Capone. He was sexy, wasn't he, Al? Yeah, he was sexy like you. Oh. Say, have you got any scars? No, but I can take my trousers off. <laughs> okay, well, it's like it's like porno, you say? Very porno. porno. Thank you. Uh, do you do, porno? Um, uh, um, I'll give you eight and a half for that each. Now uh, we come to a game called Video Players. This is going to feature Greg Proops. So I'll give you this uh, video sort of remote control thing. Thanks, man. OK. <laughs> and, uh, and get yourself a stool and sit on that. The others are going to be um, playing, <laughs> playing parts of the film that Greg is watching on his video. So we'd like to come down ready to do that. And the way we're going to do this, I'm going to flick through the pages of Halliwell's film guide. And if somebody in the audience would tell me when to stop... So stop. stop. All right, there we are. That's, uh, oh, this is a good one, I think. It's a 1955 film from America, Inside the Walls of Folsom Prison. <laughs> <laughs> a prison riot results in the death of the governor. When a replacement with more humane ideas is appointed, this does not stop violence from breaking out again. I think it's an old-fashioned love movie, I think, this. But, uh, <laughs> so if you've got the basic plot of that, you can fast-forward, go back, do what you like, and get the others to perform it for you. All right. <clears throat> New video to watch. While I'm waiting for my pizza, I think I'll watch the ending first. Well, thank you, Warden. Well, thank you, Governor. But for your lead, we would never have quelled that prison riot. I'm sorry I didn't get the phone call in on time, but that's the way things go. Well, luckily, my messenger with the last-minute orders managed to get through the crowd and managed to save the day. Well, once again, thank you. Thank you very much again. <laughs> wow, this part's really boring. I think I'll go to the beginning. <laughs> Oi, lads, come here. I don't like the governor. I think we should have a riot and kill him. I agree. With such a plan, how could we possibly fail? <laughs> Listen, I've made these guns out of squeezy bottles. Oh, I got it wrong. I've been making squeezy bottles out of guns. <laughs> you fool. I've been doing lots of washing up, though. <laughs> Come on, let's jump on the wardens now. There they are, over there. Right, OK. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's got soap in his eye, anyway. <laughs> this this is a... part's hectic. I think I want to watch it again. <laughs> I'm going to rewind. Hey, you boys! <laughs> no, no, not that part. I want to go a little bit further forward towards the squeezy bottle part. Ah, uh, squeezy bottles. <laughs> oh, no! I've been making squeezy bottles out of guns. <laughs> no, you fool! Right, let's go and get the warden. He's over there. Shall we, shall we jump on them? Yes. <laughs> Seeing as we did last time. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> I know there's a big prison riot sequence in the middle here. I'm going to go right toward that. Fast forward. <laughs> we want this woman out of here. Yes. <laughs> we want a prettier one. <laughs> 
women in this jail or we riot! Huh? Yes. I can't stand any more of this. What are you doing with that squeezy bottle? <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Yet again, I'm sad to say, uh, no points there for Paul Merton. But now we can.